I improved on all my times, all my strike stuff, bench and everything, so I feel a lot better and I put on a lot more weight. So, so you've added 20 pounds and gotten faster. Yeah, yeah, so, uh, and, and that's all a tribute to Coach Andrews and what he does, um, and his staff, uh, Coach Drab, Coach Red, Coach Drab, but, um, yeah, it's, it's been a good offseason, I'm excited for the year. And you, and you feel it too, is when you're throwing and, and everything that you're doing? Yeah, you definitely feel more powerful, and also with, with putting on weight, your muscles are bigger, so it's all about recovering and, and stretching out, and, and Coach Andrews takes care of all that for us, and it makes us feel good. Really really what did you learn your last year, and then to have to kind of switch offenses, how has that affected? Um, well, it was cool to kind of see how, how two offenses differ um, and, and how coach call, uh, how the coaches call them. Um, but I think Coach Ripple does a really good job of what I said, putting, them, putting out some good spots um, and kind of setting us up for success. And it's all about going out and executing and, and getting reps and, and, and learning how to, how to execute the play. So. What happens to the biggest difference that you talked about there? You know, we're here just to a new staff. What uh, just kind of go 100 miles an hour with everything you do, because um, they're going to want to do things differently. Uh, and you kind of got to be on the move and, and, and ready for that with the, with the way that reps are are uh, split up differently and, and, and how the tempo of offense goes and, and what they exactly like to do and, and what their coaching style is. You kind of just got to adjust on the fly and, and get moving. A lot of different guys in there with different experiences in that quarterback room. What's the dynamic of that room like? Uh, it's a lot of fun, uh, and, and we have a like you said, we have a lot of different guys from different spa uh, different places. Um, like like Jeff has been all over the place, um, and, and Kenny's done a great job here. Uh, and seeing kind of how Davis does things too, it's it's interesting, and I, I think I bring my own element to that too. So it, I think we all feed off of each other and do a good job doing that. So. What are you learning from Coach Whipple? A lot of different uh, things that how he teaches it, um, how teach how he teaches quarterback play and, and the offense, and, and kind of if, if he wants us to slow it down or, or speed it up, um, he kind of teaches us how to play on the fly, and teaches us stuff, stuff like two minute drill, um, kind of repping that and, and how to just a little tips and, and stuff like that to do a good job there. So he, he teaches us a lot. I feel there's like a, like a one on one competition between you and Jeff for the backup job. Uh, yeah, I, he uh, Coach Whip has us alternating on and off, um, getting the same reps in the same situations and seeing how we both doing them. Uh, and it's definitely competitive between us, but, but we're professional about it. And uh, and I love Jeff. We do a good job of pushing each other and, and keeping each other going. Pick each other's brain. You know, after yeah, practice. yeah, definitely. Uh, he he's asking me what I see, and I'm with how much experience he has being at two different places and, and being the starter at one of them. Mm -hmm. uh, he has a lot of different uh, ideas to give me and, and kind of tell me what, what he thinks and I'll give him the same on the plays that I rep that he doesn't. I'll tell him what I see so it's a good relationship that way.